Hi, this is um, Dan Soy Cook, USA, Canada, Philippines, aka Batman in the Kitchen. Welcome to the Food Zone, where we take this journey together, learning recipes as one. I didn't um, cook this before, this is new to me. So we're going to make a chicken, ancho, pepper adobo. I hope I'm saying that right. Maybe I'm not pronouncing it right, but it's definitely a pepper adobo. I bought this sauce for a dollar. It pays to shop around for last chance sales because sometimes you can get things that they're getting rid of certain stores for really cheap. So I got the sauce for a dollar and um, it saves a lot of steps plus it creates a good meal. So um, for today's um, recipe, we have um, onion, yellow pepper, cilantro, romaine lettuce, and here's that sauce that I got for a dollar. The pepper adobo. If I'm saying the other word wrong, um, I apologize, but um, that sauce only costs a dollar, and that can create this um, pepper adobo, and um, really good meal, I mean really good meal just for a dollar. But um, I'm going to be using grilled chicken, but with this adobo, you could um, either use beef, or you could um, use pork, it's all up to you, or you can even use um, fr uh, fish, like shrimp. So um, we're going to start off with the small pan today, I don't have my mother's one. Um, Paula Dean, she's really famous in the USA and throughout the world, so we're going to cook it in this. It's not going to take that long since this grilled chicken is already cooked. And um, this is like a meal that you can make in 10 minutes or less. So we're going to start with some olive oil in the pan, and we're going to throw in the onion and the um, cilantro. So let's get started, folks. All right, so we'll get started first with um cutting this onion. You could dice it, mince it, cut it into strips. It really doesn't matter. Whatever is your preference. All right, so we're done cutting that up. I basically just chopped it. To me, there's really no preference. I don't need it minced or I don't really need it in strips. Now we're just going to throw it in the pan with some olive oil and we're going to cook that a little bit. Then we'll throw in the cilantro. All right, so we got that um, onion in there, Facebook and YouTube. We're going to cook that on low to medium. You decide. Um, if you don't really want to rush things, just keep it on low and let this cook a little bit. Right now, we're going to go right to the cilantro and we're going to um, mince that up. I took the stems off. For this recipe, you really don't want the stems. You can use the stems in other recipes. It's a plant. It's edible. But on this one, it's really best to um, pull it off the stems and then just mince it. All right, Facebook and YouTube, I got that on low, and um, I diced that cilantro. The one thing I did forget is um, it's good to throw some garlic in there. So I have garlic in a jar. Throw some garlic in there. That's what I mean about live recording and not editing. Um, I like to just to go with the flow and not cut anything out because when you cook sometimes you'll think of an idea while you're cooking so you're going to throw that cilantro in there keep this on low if you have to turn it back up to medium cook this together i wish you could smell this right now fuse all these on um, flavors and taste together and then we'll add the um chicken in the sauce and we'll be done like the pepper you can use it to garnish the top and we're going to throw this over top of um, romaine lettuce. You can throw it over rice. Do whatever you want. All right, um, YouTube and Facebook. I got that grilled chicken. You can see the marks in there. And I'm going to um, throw that in the pan. Soon we'll go to the sauce. But for right now, just take some more olive oil. And use um, whatever you want. And just mix that together for a bit. Keep it there for a minute and then we'll add the sauce. Alright, Facebook and YouTube. We got that done. Now we're going to use this pepper adobo. Like I said, I can't really pronounce this. Ancho pepper adobo, sorry. It's with roasted tomatoes. So you're going to want to look how thick that sauce is. So pour in what you think and just mix it together. I know this... um. 
it's going to cover everything but the flavor will be trapped in there then once we're done with this we're going to put it over top of um romaine lettuce romaine lettuce and um we're going to throw either some cheese on there and some um yellow bell pepper but you can do anything you want with this um, meal as long as you have the sauce you can create the flavor the texture the meal and you could do whatever you want with it so we'll be back once the sauce is all blended together all right youtube and facebook see all that sauce is um blended in it's that pepper adobo so um you can see that you could add more sauce if you want if you want to turn it pitch black you can but um or if you want to make it lightly coated you can that's what's good about cooking you can modify it to your taste so um while we were finishing that off I took that yellow um, bell pepper and I diced it up. You can mince it, cut it into strips. Like I always say, do what's best for you. I'm coming to you in 4K today. Sometimes I come to you in 4K, sometimes 1080p high definition. So um, we're going to put the, um, with this you can make a bowl out of it or plate it. We're going to plate it and we're going to put this chicken on top of um, the roaming lettuce. All right, YouTube and Facebook, we got that bed of romaine lettuce down. And then we're going to throw on top that um, pepper adobo chicken. But like I said, if you don't want to use the romaine lettuce, just plate it, just bowl it, put it over rice, pasta, whatever you want. All right, YouTube and Facebook, there's your um, pepper adobo chicken over top of the romaine. So this is a quick meal. And... um tasty and all out of a dollar sauce so now we can either do two options we could top it with that yellow bell pepper or like um jack cheese with the yellow and white it's all up to you all right so we're done with that now i'm going to take some of this bell pepper and just sprinkle it i mean like just drop it here and there you could put cheese on it but um i decided to go more healthy and just keep the yellow um pepper so you have the smoky roasted taste from the um, chicken and um, sweet taste from the bell pepper.